I shock Mr. Fans. I've been meaning to rewatch this one for a long time. Like 23 years. It's called Toga Party. Let's watch. The movie that? starts with Betty Lou yeah. confessing. I opened up the bedroom door by mistake. Right when they was in the middle. Consummating an act of marriage. No. Well, she was lying across his lap, and he was giving her the smooth side of a boar bristle brush. And Mama was just rocking back and forth, hanging on to him with one hand, grinning like a bitch in heat. Well, She's not done. I allowed him to commit cunning. 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 Oh, he went down on me. Oh, hot and wet and succulent. Just set me all aglow with animal passions and desires. He was finger looking good. Here we meet Purvis, the guy she was talking about. And I'm standing near you. My knees just start to swing. Cause when I look into your eyes, you take my breath away. That isn't love. That isn't love. And it's emphysema. So Purvis wants to make it in business, so he's going to try to hitch a ride in New York City. I'm going to New York to sing. Big damn sign on red and green says I'm still here and it's making me mean. He meets a girl on a bus and plays a song he knows. He tries to get a job. They don't like his chicken song. So he was trying busting. He got this uh, woman there to kind of dance around for him. The woman's a prostitute, actually, and her pimp tried to take all the money. Her name's Candy. But she decides to rip him off. Let it all hang out. You ain't done. Do the shorts. Do the shorts. Let's go. Must have been a bumper crop. That's the biggest cucumber I ever did see for a white boy. What you say your name is again? Uh, Purvis, man. Well, Purvis, shit. You ought to get wise. Bend over. Bend over. He meets a talent scout. Here I am. Where does that base coming from? I don't know. I'm a man with my heart and mind. Here I stand. I come here down on mama. You just tell me to fuck off. Well, fuck you back. Fuck you back. Never stop. Gonna suck my way to the top. We see some people try out different acts for this guy. Don't finger my girlfriend. You know, you're so bad, kid, your mother needs a beating. When you get him out of there, get him off. She don't like it oh. when you finger her. Off the stage. Then this woman tries to, uh, seduce Purvis. Benny Hill slapstick. I knew Chicago when they were still in Milwaukee. Who do you think made the dead grateful? Eventually he does get a job. And while he's singing, he has a bunch of topless ladies hanging on his legs, which I can't show you, but trust me, they're there. that he gets famous. Sing your song to me. 
sing of Germany. Nineteen forty-three. You stand there in your garden. Your jackets gleaming. My heart is screaming. Just one kiss. My little rat. He enjoys the excess life of a rock star, drugs, sex, threesomes. Meanwhile, Betty Lou has come to New York City in an effort to try to find Purvis. She wants to bring him back home. No purpose has been there. And this guy kind of swindles away Purpose's contract from her. And the priest from uh, Purpose and Betty Lou's town, who Betty Lou was confessing to earlier, has also come to New York City. Betty Lou hooks up with a prostitute. Betty Lou finally finds Purvis. How are you, Purvis? But he's oblivious. Is anything wrong? Don't you recognize me? Then he gets a makeup guy who gives him an entirely new look. Well, Purvis plays, we get a little more slapstick. The contract got torn up, too. Mr. Snake, I can't Mr. Go Snake home. tore up the contract. You can go home now. So homage to the Wizard of Oz. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. And he's back in the barn There's back no home. Like home. There's no place like home. Somehow Mr. Snake, the promoter, is there. I want to see you grow. I want to see you revolve. And if I'm lying, I mean, if I'm lying, may I get my just dessert? And that's our film. Uh, okay. All right, let's talk about this movie, Toga Party, which just showed there. Just got done watching this thing. This is a VHS tape, obviously, a big old clamshell box or uh, put out by Monterey Home Video back in the day. Um, this is a movie that I rented and copied. I had it on a beta tape, a scotch tape, and um, I don't think I ever watched it at the time. I ended up watching it maybe in the early 90s, early to mid 90s, and I thought it was hilarious at the time. Um, I also recorded a couple of the songs that Purvis sings in this movie, put them on a cassette tape because I really liked them. Um, there's no MP3 stuff back then or Apple ID or Apple iTunes, whatever. None of that stuff existed, so I had to put it on a cassette tape. So I took a whole bunch of other songs from other weird movies, put them on tape too. I still have the tape. It's kind of fun to listen to. But anyway, the movie itself, it's ridiculous. Um, it's uh, about this guy named Purvis, um, and he wants to become a singer. So he decides to go to New York City. He only has one song, and the song is about screwing a chicken, um, which doesn't get him anywhere. But then he gets in this uh, office where this woman is a, this talent scout person. He starts singing this song 
um, which is, has ridiculous lyrics too. Uh, I'm going to swim that mountain, going to climb that sea, and um, I'm going to lick every boot, uh, kiss every ass. It's a pretty actually fun song. Um, but anyway, she thinks he's sick, but she says, sign him. So she signs him. Next thing you know, he starts to get famous. He gets gigs, he gets famous, and uh, he's like a big star. Now, he left this girl behind, Betty Lou, in wherever... Uh, wherever he lived before, in the middle of Arkansas or something, I don't know. Um, and she actually came out to New York City looking for him. Eventually she finds him. Somehow she he managed she managed to get his contract tore up because he's being uh, um, used by all the people that um, uh, he's working for. Um, but she gets that contract tore up, and next thing you know, they end up going back to, um, back to the farm, I guess, and they're up in a barn somewhere. That's how our movie ends. Now, uh, this movie has a few nude scenes in it. Uh, not a ton, but there is some full frontal nudity in this as well. The, most of the entire cast has done nothing else but this film. Um, I don't know where this thing came from, but it came out in 1977. Alternate title of this movie is Pelvis. And now that obviously is a, because the guy sounds like Elvis. They call him Pelvis in the movie. Once he becomes famous, he changes his name from Purvis to Pelvis. So that's the alternate title. Of course, I always knew it as Toga Party. There's a scene on here, and I don't think that's even in the movie. There's no togas whatsoever in this movie. That was probably just a, a takeoff on Animal House so they could uh, cash in. Now, in my efforts to get all of my uh, uh, VHS and beta movies onto DVD or DVD-R, try to see if this one was available, and it is. You can get this on DVD on this thing called Toga Party. It's one of these 10-pack things that were uh, all over the place back around 2002 or so. Uh, uh, BCI Eclipse put these out. Most of these uh, 10 packs, I have 10 of them actually, are, are horror movies and stuff. And there's some overlap too. But this one is like the only comedy one that I ever found. And it had Toga Party on it, so I had to get it. Now I just looked on eBay to see if it's available. And it is available. There's one copy right now being sold of this compilation here. And it's $48. So it's pricey if you want it. You do get 10 movies, including Seniors, Getting Ways at the Herod Experiment, Incoming Freshman, which I'm going to reveal next, or review next. And some bikini movies. Uh, just quite a, quite a compilation here. So anyway, it's called Toga Party. I do recommend it. It is funny. It does peter out a little bit at the end. But the music is great. The music is just hilarious. And it just keeps you going. Again, the final uh, 20 minutes or so, it kind of slows down a bit. But whatever. It's a fun movie. I like it. And I think you will too. So anybody else out there seen this movie besides me? I don't know. If you have, leave some comments down below. Let me know what you think about it. It's called Toga Party. DVD. VHS. Watch it. Bye.